All right, so we got uh, just an average day today. Finally, nice weather, able to bang some yards out. We got 11 on the list for today, so to some that's a lot, to others that's very little, but as you've seen in uh, some of my previous videos, got some big properties where we mow. I mean, all up there, you can't even see what's up by the house, it's a whole nother freaking field just about. So, keep pushing along and uh, we'll go from there. All right, so <clears throat> another question I get asked, uh, once in a while is what kind of stripe kit do you have on the mowers? Uh, I don't have a stripe kit. I don't see the point of them. Uh, if you cut it at the right height, if you're a landscaper and you own a company, you should have commercial equipment. Um, you shouldn't be going around with Home Depot specials. I know everyone's got to start out with something, but that shouldn't be your go-to mower. Um, I have the X-Mark and the Toro both striped great. Uh, you know, you're going to get those yards where some of them just aren't going to stripe. Uh, whether it be the grass or, you know. But for the most part, you can always get a yard to stripe. Uh, for instance, I'll show you this yard here in a minute. Um, it comes out great. There's no stripe kit, and I all I did was double cut it. That's it. And that's not even with uh, mowing last week because we got skipped with all the rain. So, I'll, uh, you know. that I was just showing you before uh, about a striping real good um, the guy whose house that is he follows me on Instagram which you guys should too and he saw uh, a couple drone pictures so he asked if I could come by later tonight which is now uh, try to get an aerial picture of it so <clears throat> it's pretty cool I've never uh, never really done it for a customer before so maybe I could turn this into a little money-making gig on the side so I'll, uh, I'll put the video in the 